Yo guys and gals, what is going on man? Welcome back to another episode of Final Fantasy VII Rebirth. We are still making our way through this bloody goddamn game. I don't know if I'm starting to get a little bit frustrated <laughs> with it now. Or whether or not I'm still having fun. I'm a bit like, mmm, I don't know. But uh, yeah, we are back exactly in the same place as where we left it in the underground. We had just refreshed and re, -re zooped all of our life. Um, I'm not sure what the quest is. What's the part we're on? Uh, story. Make for the room with the terminal. Alright, we're still heading for the terminal inside of the manor. Inside of this massive, absolutely huge Shinra manor. I'm pretty sure we've cleared out most of it now. If there's a cutscene, I'll disappear. There she is! My boy, still got that key card. Gonna need a bit of time with this. Might I suggest a spot of recon? Okay. So it's not talk to the dudes and do that. So I'm guessing it. <laughs> I'm definitely going to go down this other corridor fast. Cloud. No, I can't go back now. Fuck off. No game. What's going on? Alright, I can keep walking. What's wrong? Nearly there. What is he trying to do? I don't recall giving you permission to go in there. Oh, it was an honest mistake. We didn't mean any... Ah! <laughs> don't hurt me! Please! I can explain! Drop it. <laughs> Why should I? He's trespassing, like you. Save it. I've had a pretty shit day. What a coincidence. So have I. He's not going to be fun or easy, is he? He might be fun. No! <laughs> Oh, 
That's on you. I blocked that. Fire's the weakness, okay. Sure, who Barrett's got? Don't overdo it. Need my help, do you? Uh, yeah, I think we're better off to spring Kajuta down. I'm scared now. Oh, look at him! He's gone into god mode. All right, mate. All right, mate. No, you're like, ah, So clap. Who's he got? Phoenix will bring Kajuta. Barrett needs to go. Kuraga on himself. Pat Seth can go. What we've just summoned one. Kajuta. He said that. Have fun. Blazing horn. Um, what do I need to do? I need to go item. I need to go a uh, high ether on Barrett. Back. 
Just got some sort of hit on him then. But he is about to go Super Saiyan. See you soon. Perfectly timed that is as well. Like I've got to give myself some credit there. Like I couldn't have timed that any better. Down. Still up for it. Nope. I come right away. Phoenix down. Where is it? Okay? Go, Cloud. Cloud is mega. He really is. Barrett can go limit break. Fire in the hole. God, I did 3,000 damage as well. Ah, fuck. Cloud. Limit break. Let's dance, asshole. Awesome. We got him. We got it. I know your story. Vincent Valentine, former Turk. Stumbled on your file in the company database. There's a reason you're alone in the dark down here. And that reason has something to do with Sephiroth. Am I right? That's none of your business. I only ask because you might want to come with us. I don't know whether Sephiroth is dead or alive or something in between. But I do know that if I stick with this lot, I'll find out one way or another. Is this how you want your story to end? Get out. Now. That'll be your way out then. Now we know where the temple is, let's not bother the man. Hey, Space Cadet. 
Come on. Nah, I've really got the feeling that I've missed something. I think there was a way to go back in that place. In there, to the left. And I feel that there was probably some sort of treasure in there that I feel I've missed. Part of me wants to load it again, but that's only 15 minutes. Oh. Oh, if I've missed something, then well, that'll learn me, won't it? Really? For being such a dick. I've only got myself to blame. Is Vinny gonna come with us? Think there might be top secret material hidden somewhere in here? Uh, that all you ever think about? <sighs> well, excuse me for trying to be helpful. <laughs> He's going to be with DLC, right? Like Yuffie was. I think you're going to be him in the DLC. Gotta be, right? He's a bit of a beast. And then he'll join the party in the next game. That'll be the thinking. Right, so what is the dealio? Just the head out. Hear that black materia? I'm coming for you. Oh man, my rep's gonna go through the roof. Well, it ain't like it could go down. <clears throat> oh, oh, it's on. So, <laughs> where is it? Aye, about that. What's the matter? You ain't been bluffing this whole time. Have you? No, that's not it. We could go there right now, if you really wanted. <clears throat> but before that, would you mind a quick trip to the saucer? What? Why would we want to go there? To even set foot inside the temple, we'll need to get our hands on a relic called the Keystone. Trouble is, it's been missing for nigh on 20 years. So, any guesses as to where it was last seen? The gold saucer. I know, it's a stretch, no denying that. But it's the only lead I've got. Then let's follow it. We trust you. You do? Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. Well, if we got her, once we're good, let's get a move on. Right. Right, when it comes to being good... Let's reset my parties. It's not a bad party. Cat Sif, Barrett and... Cloud, but... You know. No discounted stuff. I'll be like that. So let's find out where we've got ahead, where we are. So we're back out here, and that's the quick place to go. But we've got a side mission all the way down here. So what's the thinking? Should we make our way to it? Maybe hit that fast travel. It's currently unavailable. Okay, so it's 57 meters up the road. What's this? Is. Asshole. 
our long-awaited reunion. I'm not going with you, so back off. <laughs> you misunderstand. I'm defying my boss to be here. Because I've got a hunger that cannot be denied. My desire to see you has driven me on. That's what I get for redlining the old engine. All right, my friend, it's the final lap. So let's con it one last time! He's mine! Okay. Fuck me. I don't what to do with that then. Yeah, so he's just got mega super attacks all the time. Like, what? What the fuck is this all about, eh? Fuck is that all about? So how the hell do I beat this dickhead? That's not easy, is it? Part of me's thinking, do we have to do this yet? Yeah, I can't fast travel, so it's either just run around everywhere or just win this battle quickly. Oh for fuck's sake. Skip this. We've just seen it. Grace yourself. Okay, so there's no way to block that. You need to be away from it. That's cheating, isn't it? Oh, okay. That hits twice then. Dragon Dark Dive hits twice. But he looks like he stalls from the second time he hits it as well. No, gotta dodge it. Exclamation point moves. I won't I have to dodge. I'm just gonna hit a uh, mega potion. Where's my mega potion? Ain't dead yet. Ah, I tried to block. I tried. I really did try to block. Keep moving, keep moving, keep moving. What? for being a mercenary. 
Okay, but if you can't dodge it, how the fuck do you get around it? Alright, this is a proper tactical battle, like like a God of War battle this is. Alright, I believe I'm equipped enough to do it. This is not going to be anything short. I need to stay on the blocks. Yeah, get on with it. Staying on the fucking blocks, is it? So every time I go for a spell, he just he just quickly does a gay thing. But that needs to be keep on moving, so I can't dodge that. So how do I get around it? If I can't dodge it, how do I get around it? Nah, no way. I had him then. Okay, I'm I can dodge it when it gets to me. Dodge that second one's really fucking hard. That sinister slash. Fuck! He's gonna kill me. Block, block. Nope. Will he have time? It's Cloud gonna have time. Nope. Yes, no. Nope. Fuck off. This one's gonna be tough. This one's probably going to be the episode. As long as I've got the patience in me. So, let's do this. Right. So, let's give this a go again. Let's hopefully. It's just picking it up bit by bit by bit. I'll get there. Oh, it looks like me at the minute. Anyway. Fuck off with that bullshit, innit? Still cheating though. So I haven't worked out how to get around that yet. Still in it. Ah, I almost blocked it. Really? 
Block. Wow. Block. Oh, fucking block. That fucking sinister slash is cheating. I pushed block about a million times on that as well. Ah, silly me. That is the one where I could have got him if I just dodged again. That fucking thing. Not looking good. Feeling good. No. Damn it. Get away, Cloud. Oh. Yeah. Oh, oh, oh. I won't give up. the best I've got so far on him. He is good as dead. Okay. You okay? No, he's gonna go up to the next level. Uh, 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 I won't have your pity. This is a race, remember? Come on, Cloud. We're on the home stretch. Okay. No, give me a- no! No! You can't do all those attacks and then before I even get a chance to fucking heal myself, do another five. That's fucking dog shit. That's cheating. Because I couldn't have moved even if I wanted to. You fucking piece of shit game. Fucking piece of shit. I fucking had him, man, as well. Why did I take my finger off the block button? Was just a block one of my best moves like that. Open up. Why did I take my finger off the block button? I've got to stop healing so close to him. Real sideways when he's about to do that one. Ah, 
you've got me just. Really just. I need to move yeah, now. Uh, spells. The only spell I can really do is cure Agony. Let's try that again. I don't really mind. I'll save all of my energy for life. That's not fair, because I'll just block two of his really good attacks. Won't last long. No, stupid idiot. Oh, oh, oh. I can do this. I know I can do it. This is fucking frustrating. I'm out of fucking beers as well. Well, at least in here. All right, one more go. I was gonna go get another beer, but if we don't do it this time, I will go get another one. For fuck. Brace yourself. Don't get too wild. Come on. Give us a hug. to go back the other way but I just wasn't quick enough Then I tried to go, but I just... That sinister slash is a beast of a move. It's, it's the only one I haven't really got down yet. Like, he hasn't hit me much for that. Didn't get to use that braver strike when he's. I got him down real okay? low last time. He looks a bit like Geralt from The Witcher. Though. I won't have your pity. This is a race, remember? Come on, Cloud. We're on the home stretch. Cool. Oh, what's the deal here? Right, mega potions is quicker, I think. Ain't dead yet. <laughs> what? That moved. I can't move like that. Yeah. 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 
Get ready. So long. How the fire hates it! Now you can't just can't stop spamming moves. This is what he did last time. I couldn't. I can't. How can you stop that? How can you stop? You can't stop it. I was pushing blocks and everything. Fucking, 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 fucking what? Right. Let's give this fucking shit a whirl, shall we? Let's get me hood up because when I put the hood up again, it means I'm in business. Nah, it's, they don't mean that. I'm in a dressing gown, just chilling out, playing Final Fantasy. No one means business. It's stressful. But it's not serious, is it? It's not brain surgery or rocket, rocket science. Right, I'm going to actually put myself into a full screen so I can actually see the full monitor. Right, fuck off, cutscene. Why? Just give me from the battle. Whatever. No holding back. It only takes him a second to actually recover after that move. No, 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 that ain't hit me in ages. No, 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 no. no. Trying to block that view is absolutely dog shit. There and took that, should I? I'm misreading the battle all wrong. Ain't dead yet. Just set off another limit break then. Another braver. But this is where he goes all okay? stupid and unhittable. Uh, uh, uh. Uh, mm -mm. Oh, have your pity. Cloud. We're on the home stretch. Oh, you fucking hate you. Oh, right, that's it, he's hit me. I'm never gonna be able to oh, ow. No, I hit him with my braver strike, so don't be like that. Won't last long. I needed to hit me yeah, as well. Be careful. 
I've got him. Please say I've got him. I've got him. Yes. Yes. There's no escaping. The degradation. My friend. That won't happen to you. Don't worry. Yeah, she's right. You're gonna be just fine. Come on. The gilded saucer awaits. And the keystone. Yeah. Supporters of the Shinra Resistance Committee. My name is Glenn Lodbrock, a representative of Wu Tai's interim government. The hour is upon us when we must rise up to confront tyranny. Mere days ago, Junon's cannon rang out. A message. A declaration by Shinra's new president that he, like his father before him, would rule by fear. What's more, we recently learned that he had sanctioned the development of living weapons grown within the Mako reactors that provide power to your homes. Alarmed, we decided to seek answers. And in accordance with the ceasefire treaty, our government sent officials to investigate. Shinra promised their full cooperation. But when our inspectors duly arrived, they were mercilessly slaughtered. The footage you are about to see was taken from inside one of the reactors. This is what Rufus Shinra calls a ceasefire. Friends, we do not have our enemy's military might. Nevertheless, a righteous fury burns in each of our hearts. A fire that we may carry to Midgar. And there, together, Put the city of Mako and Misery to the torch! This is our answer, Rufus Shinra. We are ready to march. And to lead us, Wu Tai's commander, Viceroy Saru. Swinging his dick and balls about on TV and that, he don't give a fuck, that dude. Who exactly is this Saruf? The Invisible Man? Regrettably, we have no intelligence to present at this time. <laughs> then you clearly aren't looking hard enough. Look harder. Ma'am. What about that Glenn 
What's his name? Glenn Ladbrock, ma'am. Ex-soldier, P0 class, a prototype. Fifteen years ago, he was sent to Rador on a geological survey, which ended in failure and led to his defection. <laughs> a spineless deserter nursing a grudge, then. Subsequently, Ladbrok took to the road, seeking to forge connections with others who shared his anti-Shinra sentiments. Uh, if you mean avalanche, they're dead and buried. I'm afraid I do not, sir. The fall of the Republic triggered a spate of uprisings in the surrounding regions. We suspect the SRC is largely comprised of forces who were defeated during the unrest. Well, who could blame them? They fought against the Republic in the name of freedom. But when the smoke finally cleared, they found themselves under the heel of a new oppressor. Why, I'd be more surprised if they didn't hate us. <laughs> Pity about Saruf. Would be good to put a face to the name. The Ancient is en route to the temple as we speak. Pursuing her is our top priority. She will guide us to the promised land. One way or another. Hmm. Mm. Regarding the speech, sir, many will interpret it as a declaration of war. And given that it was a worldwide broadcast, it would be prudent to issue a response. I intend to make a statement. Sung, if you would. Sir. So, how exactly are we supposed to get back to the saucer? With all the mountains and valleys in between, definitely not on foot. It's just way too far. Thoughts, Kate Seth? Hey, Cat! Thoughts? Huh? Um, well, you see. Look, smoke. Maybe someone's trying to call for Sid? If so, let's hitch a ride. Whew. Breaking news at this hour. Cloud! I'm picking up proto-relic energy signals from a group of robed individuals. You are? Indeed, though I'm unable to ascertain why. So, check it out? How very astute of you. While they're not in any obvious hurry, they do appear to be heading toward a specific location. Should you find the time, I ask that you track their movements. See where it is they're going. In response to last night's illegal broadcast by the SRC... Right, so I will end this episode here, just due to the fact that I will run off and do all the side missions that are left in this area, and then we will come back and do more destroy mission from there when we're strong and powerful and ready to go in, beat up everybody else in the world. Oh, we've also got one of the bosses to do, didn't we? I've still got this boss down here that I didn't think I was strong enough to do. So we will go down and give him a pop as well in the next episode. So thank you very much for watching this one. Much love from me.